Though it was raining intermittently, a group of Baloch activists and their supporters kept standing outside the Geneva-based United Nations headquarter and protested against the atrocities of Pakistan on the Baloch natives. Holding placards and flags, these protesters raised anti-Pakistan and anti-China slogans and condemned the human rights abuses faced by Baloch people. We have been sending the same message again and again to the people inside the offices of the United Nations that the Baloch people are suffering enormously by the hands of uh, Pakistani military and intelligence agencies and these crimes against humanity are, going, uh, uh, are growing day by day. So uh, there has been some voice inside also, but our, our main purpose to, to take ac action against uh, the Pakistani atrocities by the United, United Nations uh, this is a aim that we hope to achieve by such protest demonstration, awareness campaigns and the statement inside the United Nations Human Rights Council. We are growing up and there has been a lot of growth in America. You know that in all these problems, when America takes a lot of attention, the world also takes a lot of attention. So now President Trump has already said to Pakistan that you have to stop your enemies against us. Stop your enemies. Military operations in civilian populated areas, enforced disappearances, tortured, extrajudicial custodial killings of political activists and students, mass abduction of families, silencing journalists and human rights activists, denying access to media and NGOs are some of the gruesome measures taken by Pakistan.